you want to learn how to nose ride, here are some things that you can do right now on land to build up your skills so that when you get in the water on your surfboard, you'll be that much more ready. So we're gonna talk about uh, the mechanics of nose riding, kind of how it works, um, the type of board you need, the type of wave you need, and then some strategies to put into place to make it happen. Different boards are gonna be easier and different fins are gonna make it easier. So the other thing to consider about longboards is the way that the rail is shaped. Another thing you need is an appropriate wave, which is gonna allow you to be on the nose without the nose going under. And then I'm also gonna show you some things that you can do on land to practice get it into your muscle memory so that you'll be ready when you're in the water. On the stringer. Now sometimes they're probably gonna be all over the place, 